What's up there? This is Mr. Mike Kaufman. In this tutorial, I will show you how to pin tabs as well as set up bookmarks in Google Chrome. That way you can access your most commonly used websites quickly and efficiently. All right, let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you are signed into Chrome. All right, so when I open up Chrome in the top right hand corner, you can see that no one is signed in. So I'm going to click there and sign into Chrome. All right, once you sign up, it's going to ask if you want to link uh, data, and you're going to click yes. All right, now that I can see my little profile right up there, um, I'm ready to go. Now, there is no bookmark bar yet, so what I want to do is in my three-dot menu icon, I want to customize Chrome by going down to the settings. And then I want to find out where it says show bookmarks bar, and I want to enable that. And you notice as soon as I do that, the bookmark bar appears. From there, now I just want to find the websites that I want to bookmark. So for example, right, one that I commonly use is Drive. Right, I access my Drive quite often and I want to make sure that I can access that quickly and easily. Once I go to Drive, all I'm going to do is go over there to the little star, click it, and now it's going to give me some options. Right, First, what it's called. My Drive dash Google Drive. That might be a little bit too much, so I'm just going to erase the back part to make it a little bit smaller. And it's gonna ask me where I want to bookmark it. In this case, the bookmarks bar. I'm gonna click done. And then notice now my drive is right up there. Now, another one I wanna do is my Gmail because I'm gonna access that quite often. And again, I'm gonna go through the same process. I'm gonna go over there and click on the star. And notice again, that name is not looking so good. So I might just call it Gmail. Again, in my bookmarks bar. Now I've got those two done. Now if I want to change the order of them, and I want to group them, I might want to put mail first. I just click it and drag it and drop it. So that's how you bookmark. Now, you might want to set up a bookmark folder if, for example, you're going to have a lot of sites and you don't want your bookmark bar to get too overcrowded. To do that, I'm going to do a secondary click. Right? I'm on a Mac, right? or right click if you're on a PC and I'm going to add a folder. Right, in this case, for students, you might want to add a folder for your grade level, seventh grade, and then click Save. And now notice it's up on my bookmarks bar. Now from there, let's say you need to bookmark Khan Academy. All right, what you can do then is go to the site that you're going to bookmark, bookmark it, Again, adjust the name accordingly. And then from there, if you want to put it inside your folder where it says folder, instead of bookmarks bar, you want to click and choose seventh grade and click done. And now notice in my seventh grade folder, there is the Khan Academy. So I can continue to do this until I'm done bookmarking. Now, if there's a bookmark that you do by accident or you want to remove one, again, we're going to secondary click and you can simply do delete and poof it is gone all right so that is it that is how to set up your bookmarks now one other thing i did want to um, show you is how to pin tabs so for example if you've got a lot of tabs opening up opened up because you're doing lots of different work um, you might want to pin some of the tabs that you are leaving open for an extended period of time so again using my gmail and drive as an example those are tabs that i have open throughout the day because i'm using them um, constantly so what i'm gonna do is all right, secondary click over the tab and I'm going to click pin tab and then notice what it does right it makes it small and brings it all the way over to the side I'm going to do that for drive as well and so notice I have two pin tabs I can switch the order and so forth and then I have my normal tab and again notice it can't now close it out by accident right sometimes that happens you click the X and so forth and it's nice and clean again allowing me to access um, the most commonly used sites quickly and easily within Chrome. All right, so that's it. That is how to set up bookmarks, bookmark folders, as well as how to pin tabs all in Google Chrome. Good luck.